for whatever reason, the word change came to mind. I don't know why. You know what I mean? It's like a, like a change. And so I was thinking like, why is change on my mind, you know? And then I started thinking like, what it, what is it about change that like naturally like I got no problem with? You know what I mean? Like for whatever reason, change, like I have this weird relationship with change. It's like it's always been around where I'm always adapting and I'm, I'm, cust and I'm you know, more accustomed to a lot of changes. And I feel like there's, there's a certain shakeup that you know that you need you know like when you get stagnant you know like when you feel like you're you plateaued you know not talking about exercising or or maxes and stuff like that i'm just talking about like in life you feel like you're just like in a plateau you know there's like certain things you have to do to kind of shake it shake up to like kind of like shift the environment around you you know and, and one thing that i can credit to or reference is you know when um i was listening to this to this uh interview that rusted and he was talking about you know his most recent album it's called Shake the Snow Globe, you know what I mean? Or Shake the Globe, some shit like that. I think it's Snow Globe. And he was saying, like, the, the analogy or the metaphor in that is, like, sometimes you feel like in life you just have to, like, shake things up and get back to uh, uncomfortableness and change some things, you know? And I kind of was thinking about that word myself. I was like, man, like, dude, maybe I got to do some, some, some of that in my own life, you know? Like, what can I change around? What can I, what can I you know, get the uncomfortableness? Or because, you know, because, like I said, sometimes you get to the point where everything just seems routine, you know, wake up, brush your teeth, go on with your day, home, sleep, wake up, brush your teeth throughout the day. And then you, you know, you look, you look towards the weekends, and you're thinking, okay, the weekends will be something different, you know, Saturday and Sunday, nope, same thing, wake up, brush your teeth, do whatever, brush your teeth, go to sleep, you know. And um, I don't know if that's just the parenting aspect of it lately, you know what I mean? But you don't even have, you don't even have to be a parent to, to you know, kind of get what I'm talking about or, or know that feeling, you know. It's certain real routines that you just that go on and then you're just kind of like you know i should shake them some things up you know and i thought about too like a lot of people a lot of friends who have told me in the past you know like they how they don't deal good with with uh change or they don't they're not good with having to uh um you know adapt or overcome not well actually no i shouldn't say adapt or overcome but they struggle with like new environments and new things you know some people are okay with their current current routine or current um schedule you know what i mean actually even for further more than that some people are afraid of the change you know so i, I started thinking to myself why is that you know and how i could put myself in their shoes because that's like one thing with me i try to look at you know both sides i try to put myself in other people's shoes and and see how i would react or how i would think or what's the thought process going into certain decisions like that so i know me like i said i embrace the change and i'm maybe because i've always had to adjust and adapt throughout my whole life you know what i mean so i thought like what is it about change that that scares people and it's an in, and it's an interesting thing you know when i think at, at its core it kind of like it kind of comes from yourself right what have you dealt with have you dealt through some adversity have you had to adapt have you had to change and think on the fly you know have you had to come up with new ways to find a passion or new ways to find a motivation you know how are you with new settings those are all like little key factors that go into something like that but it's a thought process and i think it's more of a mental thing that gets people at least i feel like that way some people can say you know what i'm good with uh i'm good with just not even good i'd say they're content with where they are their schedule and they actually prefer that because they know for a fact not necessarily know for a fact but they know what their you know their schedule is going to be so i try to put myself in that shoe because that's kind of the opposite of, of me you know it's actually like no actually being something that scheduled for that amount of years actually worries me like it scares me 